If you need a new case or screen protector for your phone, nothing is easier than stopping by a mall kiosk. They usually do a great job for a low price. I've done it. But if you need more extensive work, one Northern Kentucky woman just found a potential downside. Danielle Scruggs cracked the screen on her iPhone a few weeks back and decided it was time to get it replaced. We were walking through the mall and saw this kiosk and we're like, why not? So she handed off the phone at this kiosk, Fast Eye Repair in the Florence Mall. A half hour later, she had a new screen, but a new problem too. It kept turning on and off, got to the car, it wouldn't charge. She says it was fine an hour earlier. I'm assuming the screen replacement because it, the phone worked perfectly fine before. So the tech told her to FedEx the phone to the chain's lab for repair, but when it came back... Picked it up yesterday, still not working. So. Have you been able to talk to any managers? They won't give us like the manager's number or anything, or the owner's number, or the name. But it turns out almost all third-party cell phone repair facilities make you sign a waiver when you drop your phone off. It might be on paper, it might be on an iPad, but either way, it releases them of any responsibility for damages. We made calls and finally tracked down the franchise manager who said they will refund her $100 screen fee, but he explained they will not pay for a new phone because screens with broken phones often have pre-existing problems and their waiver specifically says not liable for damages. Danielle says next time she'll go to Apple with the new iPhone she just purchased. Now, mall kiosks can be a great and convenient way to get a new screen protector or case, but if you need your phone opened up, just be sure to check that kiosk for reviews first. Maybe check the Better Business Bureau. That way you don't waste your money.